Okay then, so uh, we've now got the Formula 1 Grand National on track then here at Millwall site for Chase Series round number 4. We've got uh, 10 cars on track for this one out of a possible 11 here. So 53 Nigel Foster will start on pole position. Alongside him is going to be 619 John Smith and then the back of the grade is number 15 Graham Willis. Yellow tops are 190 Wayne Pearson and triple six of Tom Drawbridge. And then blue graders are 83 Ben Singleton, 713 Phil Hilly and 532 is James Eccles. Back of the grid in the reds is 447 Adam Turner. Then we've got 293 Kevin van der Bosch starting for that no handicap as the winner of the final. Right, so this will be 60 laps of the course then for the Brisker Formula 1 Stock Car Grand National. This is going to be fast and furious stuff once again from the Formula 1 Stock Cars. Down the far side they begin to go. It's over to you, Mr. Stada. Okay, Rose will begin to rise. Here they come, turn four. Hammer drops. The thunder is heard once again. Green flag goes down. Away we go with the Formula 1 Grand National. And 619 Josephine straight away shifts the 53 car of Nigel Foster out wide on the chip shop turn, but he's managed to uh, get to the lead briefly. And uh, 53 Nigel Foster decides he's coming back down the inside to retake the lead. So clearly that lead was fairly short lived for John there. As they make their way down the back straight, then 15 Graham Willis is there in third, and triple six Drawbridge gets the bumper in on at turn three and four. 190 Pierce, and so goes clattering in with that and it shifts them both aside. 83 Singleton shuffled back by 5 3 Tuckles and 447 turns. 713 Hully has an attempted assassination of the start marsh for the misses. 15 Graham Willis and uh, 190 Wayne Pierce have a slight come in together, but they managed to survive it. 5 3 2 and 83 going side by side and 447 turning goes lambing in the that ends in tears as 15 of Graham Willis has gone around in front of those three and back Eccles into the fence so that's two cars in trouble over on turn number two right so your leader is still 619 John Smith all the way from Scotland to be with us say the furthest uh, travelling driver I would say today is triple six of Drawbridge has had all manner of trouble on the back straight in triple uh, six and has managed just about to survive it and has lost a place in the meanwhile uh, to 447 and so he just clicked at the rear wheel of 190 Pearson's car and had a moment as 15 Graham Willis visits the fence on the roadside turn. Now he's in a bruising race as Triple Six Drawbridge has now found the market tyres are fairly solid and uh, in doing so has been taken by 293 Van den Bosch and uh, I think has been able to regain the position he has rather amazingly. 83 Singleton in there as well in the John Lund replica that fires uh, Triple Six Drawbridge towards the fence and through goes uh, 293 and 83. And oh, back straight over spin out. That's 15 Graham Willis going around. Oh, Tanglet turn number two there. And up and over on the uh, second bend goes Drawbridge up onto his roof. Rode over the roll cage, I think, of the 83 car in a spectacular moment in front of the chip shop and hit the post flat out. 619 is your leader, Mr. Stadler, please. 619 is your leader. 53, 447, H293, and 190 is the top five. 713 is next. And 83 is running out the grid in seventh. There's only seven of them left running. 10 did stall, lost three of them. So it's all getting very, very busy out there in this one for the Form 1 stock cars. It's happening all over the place. There's 53, Nigel Foster now tries to take the lead. I think has got it. Yep, Foster's going down the inside of 619 Smith to take the lead. And he's gone through. So the uh, Poly Spoyer Karma Series champion in the stock rods takes over the front of the grid. 619, John Smith is uh, getting some assistance from 447 Turner all the way around the roadside turn. And Turner's now going to go charging through on the inside of turns one and two and takes over second place. They are, they are catching back markers. 713 Hully is first in line of the Lockhart sponsored cars. We're coming to uh, lap number 14, I believe. We're certainly the closing laps now of this one for the Brisker Big League. Down the back straight they go. 447 Turner's got Foster in his sights. It's Daventry versus London at the front. A battle I never thought I'd be saying. Side by side between the two of them and 447 Turner goes through. So away through into the lead goes 447 Turner. The undoubted king of the stock rods and the classic got here at OGRT now taking to the form of the ones. One more lap to go now for your race leader. He's got back markers in front of him. The back marker's gone. AC3 Singleton nearly wipes out our leader on the final lap there as Van den Bosch goes charging them for second place and gets Foster on the wide side from the handicap. J Flag at the reef for 447, 293 second from the handicap. Third is 53, fourth is 619, and fifth will be 190. Full results to be confirmed by race control, of course. Okay, Mr. Please, red flags, thank you. Red flags, thank you. Thank you very much.